Remember, we're dividing, and we have two methods for dividing. If we're dividing by one term, we write each term of the dividend, and we write it over that one term we're dividing by. And if we're dividing by more than one term, we will use long division. So notice in this example, we are dividing by one term, so we will write each term in the dividend, or each term in the numerator, if you'll have it here, over the one term that we are dividing by, 8xy, plus the next term in the numerator, 24xy, divided by 8xy, and then minus 7x over that same 8xy. Each term in the numerator, or this is actually the dividend, but each term in the numerator over that same term in the denominator. Now we just simplify. 4 and 8 have a common factor of 4. 4 divided by 4 is 1. 8 divided by 4 is 2. So I have a 1 in the numerator and I have a 2 in the denominator. Now look at your x's. Remember we subtract exponents. That will be x raised to a power of 2 minus 1 or x to a power of 1. And then we have a y in the denominator. So we simplified that term plus here x is divide out. It's a power of 1 over a power of 1. And remember, 1 minus 1 is 0. And x to a power of 0 is simply 1. The y's divide out, same reason. 24 divided by 8 is 3. And then minus. Here the x's divide out, or again you can think of this as x raised to a power of 1 minus 1, but that would be x to the 0 or 1. I have 7 over 8y. There is my result.